I'm a big fan, huge fan of C. Ronaldo. Everybody knows that. If C. Ronaldo has just one fan remaining, I am that fan. Hello, amazing people. Welcome back to Entertainment TV. This one, Nadi Umbunge of all matter. As Yule Doche don't come out, he talks and make Empress they strong. Let me quote. He said, whatever you are going through now shall pass. Be strong and late before God. Be strong, Empress. All will be well. After that post, many people have been backlashing Yule Doche. Remember addressing Empress in Jama, whose fiancé made some damaging claims about the actress while disclosing that his engagement to her is over. On Thursday, December 15th, a video of Empress in Jama displaying an engagement ring with the caption finally off the market was shared on Instagram, where friends and celebrities trooped to comment section to congratulate her on her engagement. However, remember the engagement had already been called off before the post was made. Also, the engagement post was not made by Empress, but by her fiance, Josh, baby brother. Wait, who already took control of her Instagram account? Not only that, he reached out to LIB before making the post to reveal that he proposed to Empress on August 2022. He also said he bought a ring worth $49,800 for her and that they were about to get married. But he finally ended the engagement over alleged infidelity. He went ahead to allege that Empress duped him of his money and was also cheating on him with other men. He claimed that Empress collected money from him under the guise of investing in her business, but she was giving the money to another man she was allegedly in a relationship with. He also claimed to be in possession of one sales tape between Empress and the man. This is little among the issues that Empress Njama is facing. However, Yul Idoche came out two days ago to encourage Empress to be strong. He also went ahead to tell her to be strong, that she should lay everything before God and that all will be well. This didn't go well with many netizens as majority have been backlashing Yul Idoche for this. Some said you're giving encouragement to her, but when Queen May was down with depression, where were you? For those who don't know, Queen May was the Duchess's first wife and the mother of his four kids. The netizen went ahead to say, you told her on social media that she is getting endorsements because she married Judy, because you married Judy Austin. You told the world that you did not love her, that your parents forced you to marry her because you got her pregnant. You also went further to frustrate her on social media with the video of you, your Asaba wife. Were you with her when you, she was crying bitterly in her room in the night hour? Did you apologize to her for hurting her badly before the old world? I beg, stop deceiving yourself with all this sympathy because you have a stone heart. Among the commentators is another one that said, you have been putting me and our children through a difficult time and you can't comfort them and come here pretending to comfort your colleagues. Get some senses, yo. Another one talks saying, charity begins at home. Is it not funny that someone that puts the wife and innocent children through pain is here consoling someone else? Empress that I have not even seen a post on your page before. You don't celebrate good things, except to the show fake love for people where no send you. Where are you during Peggy's wedding? Where are you during Rita's wedding? Where are you last week when Eme Carola celebrated his 18th wedding anniversary? Just because you can't keep a marriage of 18 years doesn't mean you should not celebrate those that truly know the value of marriage and thereby keeping to their marriage vow. Just be a king, said he was asked to marry many wives traditionally. 
You too came out to tell the gullible ones that God asked you to marry more wife. You can lie for Africa. After committing adultery, you decided to now put your wayward lifestyle on God. God can, can't be mocked. And I'm very sure his judgment has started with you already. This is actually little among the comments made by netizens. There are so many comments that are actually not in line with Yul Idoche's thoughts. Amazing people, kindly join in this conversation. Do you think Yul is just being sympathetic about Empress in Jama State? Or do you think he's just been doing eye service? If that is the case, share your thoughts in the comment section and we'll also be reading. Thank you for watching Entertainment TV. If you are yet to follow this page, kindly do so. And if you're watching us on YouTube, please subscribe to our channel. Thank you once again.